Look who out here at the Cavalry Classic, man. What's good, Vanna? Man, nothing. Came out here to support Duro, uh, the Oxen Hill boxing team, and their show. You know, support the people who support us. They support us. You know, they're always there when we need them. we always there when they need us. We want to come out and support them. Now, on yesterday, you was out there with Jaleel. I, I see you out there. He's a basketball player. I, I mean, I, I laugh with him, but he's just trying to, number one, stay active in between fights. And number two, he loving it because it's his community. It's the community he grew up in. They know him. And, you know, for me, the one thing I like is other young people in the neighborhood and the community ask him to sign stuff or talk to him because it makes him see that anything that you want to achieve, you can achieve it. Men with Mayweather promotions, I don't know if, if, if people realize it or if they realize it, but that's something of a big accomplishment for a youngster to see. He's there. Where can I get to? So, you know, basketball is great, but the camaraderie of the community is even better. Man, I appreciate the time as always, bro. Oh, man, we love it, man. We love it. Be, be on the lookout for his auction coming up soon. Oh, yeah, I was going to ask you about that, so it is coming up soon. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We, we, uh, ready to do that. Uh, he wanted to actually use the gloves so it wasn't just like a publicity thing if I use them once in a auction. But he's trained in them. He's actually sparred in them. He'll sign them and they'll be part of the auction. Okay. That's the man here. The other man. Man, what you doing up here today, Jalil? A lot, of people, I can't say, see some a lot of people say next up, next up. He's already up. It's not next up. It's up right here. <laughs> Okay, this is some real fights, man. Nah, 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 I, I, I see you hit that three yesterday again, man. You, yeah, that man. corner three, man, is your spot, I see. Well, right at the, right before you get to the wing, man. I just need to get hit in my shooter spot. <laughs> you say give it to your shooter yeah, spot, you got it all day. Shoot, that's what's up, man. I gotta be right back up in here again tomorrow. My daughter be fighting uh, with the uh, mixed martial arts yeah, on tomorrow. That door. Yeah, that's next door. That's a special one. Huh? Oh. Yeah. It's youngest like him that I really like watching them come to fight because they fight like pros a little bit, but it's upbeat. So it's like, yeah, man. This definitely gonna be, definitely gonna be a good one. What fight you looking forward to coming up next, man? Honestly, as far as the pros or today? Well, yeah, we can do both today I'm and the pros. Today I heard uh, my man Waterboy, I don't know why I can't think of Waterboy's real name, him and Nasheed fighting, so Big Boy's going to rumble. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah, I, got, I can't wait for that. They going to rumble. <laughs> and, um, as far as the pros, I'm looking forward to that Canelo Triple G. That's the that's Now, are we going to get that Earl? Crawford fight, man. I'm not, I'm not speaking on the fight until I see it posted by one of those big names. Man, that's, that's, that's why you that's ain't seen me talking about it. I tell people, I say if I see Showtime, PBC, or, or one of them say something about it, or Sam say something about it, about the date and everything, then that's when the fight's gonna happen. But until then, it's just tough. Gotta sit you back know, and wait. I tell people, you don't remember, you know how long Manny Pacquiao and Floyd was supposed to fight each other? For years. They were supposed Before. to fight forever. And then, what, on damn that decade later they end up fighting. So, um, honestly, I just, you got to wait till it's, it's in writing. And even when it's in writing, we don't know. <laughs> because... <laughs> I got to ask you about this gear too, man. What's, what's up with the scoop again? Uh, I got, I got a, a friend of mine, a cool guy, shout out Ryan. He, um, this is his company, so every time, every time something drops, you know, he sends it to me. I'm like, it's, it's brand ambassador on the athletic side of the world. You know, um, me and uh, Chris Santo, Lucio, you know, he's five and oh, four knockouts. Uh, we both of us are brand ambassadors in this area, so yeah, now nah, we be rapping for him. You know, if, you, if you ain't copy already, make sure y'all copy. I'm like, here's fire. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I've been peeping you wearing it. I've been peeping. I wore, I wore uh, the whole sweatshirt. Where they located? He's in Texas. Really? He's in Texas. But he Damn, got, how did he contact you all the way from Texas? Uh, he just reached out to the DM? Santo connected us. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, nah, but, um, yeah, nah. If you haven't already copped your merch, man. Yeah. Uh, he, he dropped, he dropped consistent. And he, he always, he real in touch with all this. And it looks like really nice quality, too. Yeah, nah, man. The, got the little silk hood and everything. Yeah, I man. see that. You know, he, all he, stitched he in. 
take his time with his with his work, you know. So then uh, if you haven't already go shop with him. Oh, and also, man, for the people that don't know, you got the auction coming up soon. Oh yeah, no, I've definitely I've got a lot of athletes to donate things. I got two guys in the league, you know, give up game worn cleats, game worn jerseys. A couple fighters gave up gloves that they fought in. Um, so, you know, any athletes, like I said before, just reach out to me, you know, just get it to me, sign, and, you know, 100% of everything that's made is going to the auction to help with you. Man, I really appreciate your time, big dog. It's oh, no, all right. definitely. I appreciate you. Oh, I was going to... Oh, no, it's not up here today. I was going to say the, the, the glove that uh, that your auction off is actually the no. Ukraine, the Ukraine. Yeah. I've been telling people, a lot of people be asking me about the gloves. And I have people say, oh yeah, we're going to buy the brand of blue pen. That's what you for. I say, if you buy it, that's up to you. But I prefer for you to buy the Ukraine one. Number one, they're cheaper than my pair, the, the red and blue pen that I fought in. And number two, 100% of your purchase goes towards helping Ukraine in the, in the hard time. In the so I say, you know, buying those, is, is, it goes to a bigger cost. Now I gotta ask you, uh, while I got you, man, what you've been in hit and move for a while now? Yeah. How you really like the gloves? Man? I love them. Um, yeah, no, it's, it's it's honestly it's it's one of those gloves where you, you really can't go wrong. You know they make a, a puncher style glove with a little bit less padding than a knuckle, but still great support throughout the whole hand. And then you got you know the the, the well protected gloves like like these ones that you see here, where like you know. These are these are made like the fight glove. These are also this is oh this is an eight ounce, which is man, the fight that glove. Eight ounce is crazy right there. Yeah, man, I ain't gonna lie. You know they they, they kill somebody. Them two. Yeah, nah, they keep they, they they keep me good, man. So yeah, nah, I definitely I definitely I don't I don't tell people you know go buy you a hand move. I say try the glove on yourself and you know do some work in it. After you after you do that, then you decide. Appreciate your time as always, you know. Hey man, I tell everybody about the uh, I forgot too, man, about the, about the show, the podcast, man. man. The podcast. I'm thankful for all the support that we've got in the past few weeks since we started to now. You know, with no with no paid promo or anything, we got we got 300 followers in two days. Damn. So yeah, nah, I'm I'm thankful. You know, we're gonna grow it one step at a time. I was telling my brother, I say it's not gonna be like me. You know, we just wake up and it's all success. I said, we're going to have to keep grinding, keep working, keep knocking out interviews and stuff until, you know, we get to the point where we really up there. Yeah. But, yeah, now we're going to keep grinding. Make sure y'all keep up with the podcast. Follow the podcast on Instagram at Mike's Money and Gloves. Mike's Money and Gloves on the podcast. We, we get on there for our regular discussion every Wednesday and Friday. But for any other interviews, we, we pop up any day. And, um, we're very interactive with all our fans, so when you reach out, we, we're going to get back to you as soon as possible. That's what's up, man. Appreciate your time as always, Jaleel. Appreciate you. All right, we out.